Okay, take three. <laughs> Rise and shine. Just kidding. Good morning, everybody. So I just woke up. Not literally. I was on the phone with my cousin for like a very long time. But today, I'm finally dyeing this hair red. I'm over here eating. Horrible. I'm finally using this Moroccan oil hair dye. You guys don't understand. I've been trying to film this video for about three times. And each time, like... I have plans and then I have to go do something or like someone hits me up like F me, da, da, da. so today I'm finally gonna do it I'm like determined to do it I don't have work till 5 30 so we're just gonna make we're gonna make time for it it's gonna happen um before I start that I'm just gonna do like a quick little skincare while I'm doing that just because like I love doing skincare it's like my new favorite thing and so I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna use today so I'm gonna start out with this Caudalie milk cleansing gentle milk cleansing cleanser i got it for my job and i just love the way it makes my face feel i love anything with almonds in it and this has almond in it and so it's just like really soothing and it's just like i don't know it just feels really good it's soft it's soothing so i'll be right back i'm gonna go wash my face okay so face is washed kind of still looks the same because my face was still clean from last night when i washed my face so now i'm gonna use two masks one for like my oily skin because my nose just gets insanely oily like i don't know if it's because it's been warm but like i just have really oily skin. i scratch out what i was saying because i was just going off in a tangent but anyways i have really oily skin i don't know why but like this area insanely oily and so like whenever i do my makeup i have to put like powder here or else it's gonna look a mess so today for my oily skin i'm gonna be using purity's clay mask and i absolutely love this it's pore extracting so it like helps pull out like it helps with all your pores and it helps with oily skin so i definitely recommend this to anyone who has oily skin So you just want to make sure to do clay masks in your tea spot if you're oily so because these are the most oily spots and you guys don't have to do like this area but i just know like excuse me <laughs> i just know that i get so oily like even here so i'm gonna put my clay mask here and this mask you leave on for five to ten minutes but i'm probably gonna do like 15 minutes just because I don't know, just cuz. So I'm gonna set my timer on my watch and then I'm gonna show you guys my next mask. So my next mask that I'm gonna do while the clay is on is this Honey Potion um, mask by Pharmacy. So it's just hydrating and has an antibiotic antioxidants in it and so i'm just gonna put this all over the other part of my face and you're supposed to spread like it looks like honey it's so cool but you're supposed to um, put it on your face and then you're supposed to massage it in and it turns to like this white like cloudy color which i think is pretty cool okay so now that I have my clay mask and my honey potion mask on. I am going to start looking at the hair mask. Woohoo! Um, this is gonna stay on for 15 minutes. So I already set my timer already. It is going off. Okay, so finally we get to try this. So you want to apply a generous amount to towel dried hair, which my hair I washed yesterday, so it's already dry i'm getting my hair done next month so i'm like why not just dye this hair while it's in because it's about to be gone anyway so i divided my hair into four sections and then i'm just gonna start off with this wow it sounded weird i'm gonna start off with this section and i already combed it out and so now we're gonna just i'm gonna take these earrings off they are in the way. So we're going to start with this section. Okay. 
Okay, so I put what I thought was good, but I still have a lot more in here. And so I'm just gonna distribute the rest all around my hair. You saw probably that I got really excited up here because I could actually see the red, which is like what I was hoping for because I'm not sure if this is gonna work. And like, I don't know if I mentioned, but it's a clay, not a clay, it's a hair mask. So it's not like, it's not like um, I'm actually dyeing my hair. It's just temporary. So I'm just trying to see if it actually works, especially because I have dark hair. So I don't know, like, I know for sure if I had lighter hair, it would probably work way better. But this is dark hair, so I just don't know how it's going to turn out, you know? It's always, like, turns out different on dark hair. Uh-oh. So I'm just gonna finish the rest on my own and then I'll be back to tell you guys some more details. Okay, so my timer went up a while ago. I really just wanted to finish this hair. Now I'm gonna go rinse it out and I tried to use all of it. I literally squeezed the life out of this thing. But I recommend if any of you do this mask, please wear gloves because this is not cute. But like happy Halloween kind of, right? That's what it looks like. And so I'm just like, I have like a little bit left. I really don't know where I want to put it. I feel like I want it in the front just cause like, I want people to see it, but it's also important to have it on the ends. And you're supposed to just leave it on for five to seven minutes. Honestly, it has been that long since like I originally applied. And you can really see that. I just hope it still shows when I wash it out. And I also would recommend Please wear a shirt you don't care about. This shirt is from Pink, and I'm probably never gonna wear it again because it has red all over it. So that shirt's out. Usually I know that, but I guess I wasn't thinking. So I think we are all good to go. I'm just gonna wait like three more minutes, hop in the shower, and then I will show you guys what it looks like when I'm out, and hopefully it is still red. Okay guys, so I just came back from washing my hair and my face, and I'm kind of sad because I don't really see the color as much. I'm gonna like 
cook some lunch and let it dry and hopefully then you'll see it i tried to like barely oh you can kind of see it i tried to like barely rinse my hair because i really wanted the color to stay because you know it's a hair mask it's not like permanent hair dye so i didn't know like how effective it was gonna be. So I'm hoping when it dries, you'll be able to see it because I did leave it in like for a long period of time. So we'll see. And as for my hands, this is what they look like. So most of it got out, which like scared me. So I'm like, is most of it out of my hair since most of it is out of my hands. But I didn't use like any conditioner or anything when I rinsed it. I'd literally like, when I was in the shower, just like, uh, and then came back. So I'm hoping like it stays, but yeah, I'm gonna let my hair dry. I'm gonna go cook and then I will check back in. And then towards the end, I'll just show like my final look with like makeup and everything. Okay, you guys, so I'm still like doing my makeup, but I just decided since my hair is dry to show you guys how it turned out. So I feel like in the sun, you can slightly see it. So I'm kind of excited with my results. Um, I have no like products in my hair right now. This is straight from the mask. So it made it really hydrating. And it's like super curly and like it feels nice. It's shiny. As for like the red, like yeah, you can definitely see it. Like it's like a tent. You can see the tent in the sun and I just love it so i would recommend getting it but um just know it's not hair dye and like yeah just know it's not hair dye and yeah so this is a video on the moroccan oil bardo i think that's how you call it bardo red hair dye hair mask hair mask everyone hair mask temporary and it shows a little bit in the sun. It makes your hair really curly and moisturized. So yeah, thank you for watching. This is like my first like actual video I'm gonna post on YouTube. So let me know what you think. And I hope you all have a great day. Okay, bye.